When the battlefield is frozen and every breath feels like daggers, legends are carved in ice. Step into the chilling saga of the 1967 NFL Championship, the Ice Bowl. December 31, 1967, Lambeau Field, a tundra set for an epic showdown between the Green Bay Packers and the Dallas Cowboys. But the real opponent? The brutal cold. Two titans clashed, each step a testament to their tenacity. The icy grip of nature turning every move into a game of survival. It wasn't just a championship at stake. It was about enduring the harshest elements for the ultimate glory. Welcome to the Ice Bowl, the coldest game in NFL history. As the whistle blew, warriors of the gridiron battled not just each other, but the icy breath of the Arctic itself. Adaptation was key. With frozen turf and numbing cold, it was innovation out of necessity. Every tackle, every sprint, a defiance of the Sub-Zero Siege. Halftime offered no respite, only the chance to strategize against an invisible foe that turned sweat to ice and breath to frost. In the theater of the chilled, it was Green Bay's iron will against Dallas's resolve. Each play was more than a move, it was a statement. As minutes waned, the Packers trailing by three embarked on a final drive, a march of icy determination toward destiny. Then, with mere seconds ticking, Bart Starr's sneak pierced the Cowboys' line, a touchdown that was less about points, more about immortalizing willpower. The horn sounded, and amidst a frozen cauldron of cheers, the Packers emerged victorious. The ice bowl was settled, the Lombardi trophy theirs once again. But as legends walked off the field, it wasn't just a game they left behind. It was a legacy of grit and the heart of the National Football League, forever etched in ice. Decades on, the whispers of that icy day resonate, a testament to endurance, a reminder that in the NFL, greatness knows no temperature. The Ice Bowl, not just a game, but a freeze frame of football's fiercest fighters, a story where the chill still hangs in the air and the spirit of the game burns eternal. Star begins to count. probably the greatest played in all the 15 years when he fell over for that touchdown and 